The combination of conflict, environmental stress, and traditional gender roles all fuel the food crisis in South Sudan. GenCap's gender analysis helped identify the opportunity to include women to help increase food security. In a break from tradition, all of the students in this farming school are women. Mother of four young children, Abak Garang welcomes the chance to learn new skills with other women. I am very happy to be alone without men in the women's groups. We like to be alone because we women. The way we do things is quite different from the men. So when we are mixed together, men might dominate the groups. <laughs> With the help of FAO, the women are planting now and planning for the future. <laughs> and like most plans for the future, today's work isn't a matter of tomorrow's harvest. These trees won't produce fruit for at least five years. Some of what's taught in this farmer field school is not always what has been done in the past. It is men. It is men who have a knowledge of transplanting trees, yeah. And then after that, women will take care of watering. Yeah, that is how it used to be. With coaching from local NGOs, women learn everything from seed to market, including soil health and community health crop rotation, and math equations. <laughs> now women, wives, and mothers are getting the skills they need to protect their crops and their families for the long term. I'm very happy I am in the school. I didn't know how to transplant or how to grow vegetables. It is women who are, who are very care, careful about uh, taking care of the family. So when they are taught, given this skill, and they, are, they go and implement it, they will provide enough food for the family. So the food security will improve. There are different varieties of vegetables we are growing here, like kale, which can be made into a broth for the family. We used to eat just one type of broth, but now we cook the kale in different styles and people have improved their diets. Like many of the women here, Abak Garang hopes her daughters will follow her example. I have already encouraged my daughters to go to a school like this. In all farmers' field school, majority are women because of, of their commitment and their willingness. And also, they will be good teachers. What they learn here, they will pass to their kids. Giving the next generation the power to grow food and cultivate security. Yeah. 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 Yeah.